Welcome back to the 1994 World Championships. The final match of the weekend. Open singles final on the left of your screen. Big Terry Moore on the right. Tom Spear. Terry Moore, of course, originally out of San Diego, California, now playing out of Chicago, Illinois. Tom Spear out of Denver, Colorado. Here's Moore now with the first scoring opportunity of the first game. Rolling back and forth, looking for the hole. Tokes it to the near side to make it 1-0. Jim Stevens along with Evan Stachlick, bringing you the open singles final. Great to be here, Jim. I believe Terry Moore, three straight at Tom, coming out of the loser's bracket. And I also recall Tom Spear, was it three games straight to put Terry into the losers? Might have been four. Either way, he did, yes. In that first match, Terry Moore shot 12 of 18 for 67%. Down the middle goes Tom Spear, stroking it home to tie it up. Now that was one of those Tom Spear shots where he knows it's his drop and he possibly goes for the bank that might fly off and it banked right in the corner. Here's Terry Moore. Goes along the wall with a pass attempt. In fact, Terry Moore used that wall very effectively in the first match. You must take away the wall on Terry Moore's five. Here's Terry Moore rolling back and forth, looking for the hole, and he finds it as he strokes it to the far side to make it 2-1. So Terry's two for two to start this match. As I said, he was 12 of 18 for 67% in the first match. Tom Spear only six of 17 for 35% in that first match. Terry Moore now possession of the ball. Upper left-hand corner. Terry Moore, the world's number one rated player, the 1992 world singles champion. Tom Spear, the 1989 Masters singles champion and one of the great players of all time. Pull kick attempt rolls around, grabbed in the goalie area by Tom Spear. And that's the same zone that Spear did, jumping back to the pits when he put Terry into the loser. So let's see that throughout the whole match, Jim. Here's Tom Spear, lower right-hand corner. Short side effort blocked right back into the goal by the five of, Tom, of Terry Moore, and it's 3-1 Moore. Spear seems to not be controlling the pace of this game right now. Terry is, he's real fired up coming out from ball one, and Spear needs to slow it down and control everything on the five because he's got one of the greatest five bars ever to play the game. Spear with a pass attempt blocked by the five of Terry Moore rolls into the goal area of Tom Spear. Trailing three to one here in the first game of the open singles final and Terry Moore steals the ball and calls timeout. Let's introduce the officials for this match. Across the way there you see Dave Council. Outstanding official out of the Denver area. On the near side, Rick Macias from North Carolina. Moore touches two to put the ball back into play. Sets it up in that front pin position looking to take a 4-1 lead in the first game. Rolling back and forth looking for the hole. And he finds it as he strokes it right down the middle and Terry Moore is playing great. He really is. It looks like he's in full control of the momentum. Besides, his shot is really scoring great. And I remember the way Spear put him into the losers was he really blocked his shot good and controlled it on the five. Spear can't hold on to the pass. It's stabbed up by the five-man effort of, to of Terry Moore. Comes all the way back to Tom Spear on the three. Tom needs to get something going right here. Setting it up in that pole shot position. Shooting against Terry Moore. Spear. Tried to stroke the long. Moore knocked it down. Nice save. Pokes at it into the goal. And the first game goes to Terry Moore. Great hustle play right there, Evan. Yeah, the hand speed, the momentum, the fired upness. It's right now an attitude. Spears a little lackadaisical. Terry jumped to a quick lead, a couple breaks, and Spear just didn't really try to get back in the match. And Terry continued to finish him off. And that's when the breaks go your way, Jim. 